I'm Beth Ray from Must Ministries, and I'm on the heels of a woman. Beth Ray, one of the phenomenal speakers on the hills of a woman. Thank you for taking the time to sit down and have a private exclusive interview so we can get a little bit of what your business is and talk a little bit about what you presented to the women in the audience today. I work for Must Ministries. Must is a 43-year-old social service agency. We started in Powers Ferry United Methodist Church helping children with tutoring and driving women and um, older individuals to doctor's appointments in the grocery store. Wow, excellent. Now, you also mentioned um, the Must Marketplace. You have to talk about that thrift store. Tell Absolutely. us about that. Absolutely. The Marketplace opened in January. Mm -hmm. um, and if it had not been quite so warm today, I would have worn my new outfit from the thrift store. Uh, but um, we receive a lot of clothing that we give to our clients. And we will continue to do that. But we also receive a lot of extra things that we may or may not have a use for. So we've opened the marketplace in order to sell those items to um, raise funds to keep the business going. Because as we know, um, the funding from agencies is dropping, the funding from government is dropping. So this is another way for us to be able to keep the doors open so that we can continue to offer the services. And for those that want to join your cause, where can they reach you? Okay. Um, our office is in Marietta. And our website is www.mustministries.org. And at the top, it says Be Help. And you can click on that and pull down the menu, and it gives you an option to volunteer. It also gives you an option to donate. L.R. Johnson & Associates. I'm the VP of Marketing there. We are an insurance and financial services consulting firm. We are totally independent. Um, and what we do is customize life insurance portfolios for individuals. We are not, um, we don't have a relationship with one insurance company because we mm -hmm. don't believe that one insurance company has all the answers. We believe that the client who we're sitting in front of is the best navigator for which way they want to go. And then we go back to our bookshelf Mm -hmm. of life insurance companies and we say okay that one would suit their need that one would suit their need and so then we present our recommendations um, and so that's what we do is customized insurance portfolios on the other side our nonprofit I am the director of operations there one of my other hats that I wear mm -hmm. um, we uh, it's called the Ronco Johnson Foundation for Financial Literacy where we partner with other organizations to implement a financial literacy program in their organization to teach to their community. Leveraging your power um, with life insurance policies, mm -hmm. talk about that for the people that weren't here. Well, what I was explaining was how you can use the leveraging power of life insurance to give to your favorite charity. Now, one of the things as black folks that we don't know is that our Caucasian brothers and sisters have used it for hundreds of years. And if I can just kind of give a brief history lesson, if you think back to slave trade and the masters and the owners that owned ships, when they shipped cargo, mm -hmm. their cargo was insured. Mm -hmm. It didn't matter to them if the cargo made it to the port or not. Right. Because, because it was insured. What was cargo back? People. Yes. Mm -hmm. So... Folks have been using, our Caucasian brothers and sisters have been using life insurance for generations. Us as black people don't always know what you can use it for except to bury our loved ones, and that's mm -hmm. not true. Businesses like JCPenney was started from the cash of life insurance policies. If people are interested in starting a portfolio, how will they reach you? Um, you can go on our website, www.lrj-associates.com. Uh, my email address is ksmith at lrj-associates.com. But I really love to talk to people. So you can call me at 770-321-1337. 
I'm Kelly Smith, VP of Marketing at L.R. Johnson & Associates and the Director of Operations at the Ronco Johnson Foundation for Financial Literacy. It's been such a pleasure to be here and you are on the heels of a woman.